All right, so hello everyone. Welcome back to another video. So welcome back to Vanilla Terraria. So I know in the past before I have tried Vanilla Terraria playthroughs where eh, I, I, I honestly stated that Vanilla Terraria kind of got a little bit for me and it was just kind of hard for me to do a normal playthrough of it. So today I'm going to change, I'm going to raise the stakes a little bit and we're going to try it on expert mode. Uh, I've never actually played on expert mode just for the sake of I'm not very good at Terraria which that could be shown in many examples but I'm not I'm not very good at Terraria and so to do it in expert mode could either be really fun or just flat out suicide so you know I don't know let's create let's create a different looking character this time so you know we're gonna we're gonna see how this goes I cannot guarantee that this is going to go well but I hope it goes well because I've always wanted to play Expert Mode Terraria. So I guess in the inevitable, we'll find out. Alright, there he is. There's our character. He's beautiful. I love him. Uh, we're going to keep the character soft core, of course. But the world is going to be on Expert. Pretty much, if you don't know, Expert kind of just takes the difficulty of Terraria. And just I don't even know if I spelled that right I don't really care uh, and it pretty much just takes it and puts it up by tenfold uh, new all right large I'm gonna go on expert I'm gonna go with corruption on this one and then we'll call this one times 10 10 X however you do I think times 10 is actually this whatever it doesn't matter there we go beautiful all right, there's the world. Now, essentially, I'll most likely cut this part out while it creates the world, because nobody wants to sit here and watch this. And this part is quite boring. All right, there it is, there it is. Terraria times 10, the expert world. Let's get straight into it. I'm excited, actually. I can't wait to see what Terraria has to offer for us. All right, so we got a godly copper sword. Uh, six melee. Uh, oh, wow. Uh, then we got an agile copper pickaxe, which is also pretty good. And it's, Oh, man, so right off the bat, we got some pretty good... Um, we got some pretty good stuff. Now, one of the things I did want to suggest was the idea of doing different kind of styles of playthroughs. Like, Because I know there's many different ways you can play Terraria. You can either be a melee person, like, or a yo-yoer, or a mage or a ranger so i was thinking like if this series does good and maybe the modded one gets enough traction would you guys like the idea of seeing me go through at some point and doing a playthrough where i pretty much try to make it to the moon lord or wherever uh modded and slash non-modded with only one class type you know and i know there's tons of ones that you can do i know there's like you can be like a, just a fisher or a farmer or stuff like that so you guys have to let me know because I love the idea of all the different playstyles you can do in Terraria and there is mods to add more different playstyles and I'd love to try them. Um, so you guys have to let me know. But for now we're just going to focus on this expert world. Um, so at first it doesn't look anything too different but even stuff like slimes are harder. Like I think slimes originally have like 25 health. Like look at that. Like even slimes do more damage, they hit harder. Um, bosses are ten times harder. They have like the brain of Kaluthu has more phases than normal. But actually, though, for those who don't know, for those who either don't watch Terraria videos much or have just never done an expert world, if you kill a boss in like in expert mode, you get a goodie bag every time you end up defeating them. So I think that's pretty cool. Um, and hopefully, hopefully this goes well. But we'll never, we won't know until we know, I guess. So, I don't know what I'm going to do for a house this time. Uh, I kind of want to, like, I don't want to do an underground bunker since I'm doing that in the modded playthrough. I might like to, I don't know. You know, I'm honestly, like, I don't know how I want to take this at this time because I just, I know some of the threats of hard mode. Uh, or expert mode, whatever you want to call it. And it's just, you know, sometimes you're scared, sometimes you're not. But I do want to use like this thin piece of land right here as property for my house because it's not where I spawn, so it keeps me away, it keeps me safe, and it's a good place for a house. 
And Bunny, that was your own fault. Oh, can I help you? Um, I do want to make a wood sword after I fight, after I get everything kind of set up. But I do also want to kill these slimes just for the sake of getting gels for torches. And this is why I want to make a wooden sword so I have a swing instead of a instead of a poke. Um, the Halloween update is over actually, so I can no longer get any of the goodie bags. So I can't like get the costumes and stuff ripped. Um, on my modded playthrough, of course, I do have the Halloween all the time thing. But we're not, but this is a playthrough of Vanilla Terraria on Expert Mode, so we will not be doing mods. This will be just pure vanilla. Well, as pure as you can get, I guess. Can't hit that worm. Die, wormy. And even the worms are harder to kill. Come here. Yeah, come here. Hit. There he is. Alright, and of course, you know, we'll have goals such as get all the NPCs. Uh, even like the more rare ones like the party girl because she only has like a 5% chance of spawning every morning with the correct amount of NPCs. So there's definitely a bigger threat there. Alright, there it is. We'll get ourselves a workbench. Now I want to make a wooden sword and I want to get a good wooden sword since, you know, can't just give up a godly copper short sword. Sharp. Alright, decent I guess. There it is. Yep. Godly wooden sword. All right, that sounds good. So then we can just pitch these. I don't really need them anymore. That's ah, a purple slime. Good thing I got my new spin mechanic. Hi. Oh man, I'm close to death already. Come on, I don't want to die to slimes. <laughs> I'm gonna be quite embarrassed if I end up dying to slimes. I have no healing items. Well, first things first. Let's get a house going. Um, I kind of know how I want this house to go. Uh, I have like a, I have like a basic idea, I guess. Uh, I don't have it fully underway yet, but we'll see as we go along. All right, so of course, like normal, we'll do. I have to get some platforms. So of course, we'll do as usual. No! Oh, you almost got me. Yeah, that was a cheeky little move. Um, now, of course, this let's play. I will be doing all types of um stuff. So anything from mage to range to, you know, because I always mix it up and stuff. But, you know. All right, so now we're going to get the mages, little, we're going to get the guides um, little section done. Get him a nice little house built. Uh, I'm not going to be doing like a tower like I normally would. Um, I might build them all separate houses. I don't know. We'll find out. We'll see what I do. I don't even barely know what I'm going to do. Uh, I would like to do some exploring before it gets super late, to be honest. Uh, Cause I want to get that fifth. I want to get that fifty um silver pieces as fast as I can. Oh yeah, I forgot to build walls. Whoopsie. All right, let's make some torches now so we can keep this place lit up. Now let's get some wood walls going. Almost got it. Uh, I actually started a world on my own little vanilla world that's a normal playthrough. I built like a humongous mansion. But I don't want to copy ideas from my other worlds. I want to be as original with myself as possible. Okay. And then we'll just finish this all up. Because I would, I would not like the guy that would be dead. Because then I can't get the other NPCs to move in. And I ran out of walls. That's actually surprising. I don't really need to worry about making too many at the moment. Since we don't even have enough for the, the guy. Not the guy. The um, merchant to move in. And those are off-centered. So I'll make them centered. Alright. Uh, House has to be symmetrical, otherwise I am going to be upsetty. Well, it's not perfectly symmetrical, but whatever. All right, and there it is. There's our house. Oh, okay, good. He did move in. Oh, there, green slime. Oh, the guide's facing off at a purple slime. All right. 
And then for the guide, so he can actually somewhat move around. Build him like a little staircase, I guess. Yeah, I'm out of platforms. That's not good. Uh, he trapped the purple slime inside of my house. You know, I, I'm, I'm sitting here doing good things for you, and yet you do this to me. How could how could you? Yeah, I sit here, I build you a house, and yet you treat me like trash. I see how it is. I don't have to be nice to you. I'm choosing to be. I'm building you a luxurious home for your own sake and good of heart. And yet you treat me... Oh, that's that's not. No, I won't really be using it as a weapon, so I guess it doesn't matter too much, but it's still me. Beautiful, there it is. Now I can get in and out of his house. Alright. I'm gonna move this inside. Yeah, I know it's getting dark, but I kinda wanna explore just a little bit. Because I feel like I should not dolly too much. Alright, so let's go see what we can get where we can get before the night is over. And hopefully by the time I come back, uh, the, the, guide, the guide, I should actually get some stone. So that way we're not. So that way we can have a furnace. Don't want to give up on the furnaces. Oh, hello there. So that means we're really close to the corruption then. That's not a good thing. Oh, okay. Oh, so the corruption is right there. Nice. 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 That's not that's not good. That is not good whatsoever. Alright, so I guess we're gonna go the other way then. Oh, um, why didn't you, why did you break your house? Why did you do that? I walk away, I leave for two minutes and you're already breaking stuff. Alright, there we go. Okay, so let's go this way. Uh, only, only better things this way, I, I assume. I, I assume. Assume I did. collect ourselves some of this tin ore. Alright. I want to believe that it's only going to get better from here, but, you know. Life has a knock for proving me wrong, so I guess we won't know until we find out. Ah, oh, nice. And a humongous like, thing. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get across safely. I should be able to clear this. Yeah, alright. I'll have to get some platforms and build like a bridge, but for now, it's good enough. Excuse me, little duck. I need to collect this lead ore and I don't want to kill you. I'd like to find at least one chest before we get trapped inside. Okay, so we're not, I'm not seeing any corruption yet. Oh, I'm seeing a desert, though. That's making me a little uneasy. But it does have cactuses in it, and cactuses are really useful. For armor and just weaponry. Oh, that's an antlion thing. Please. Okay, we have the. I have the higher ground, Bananakin. And that's a zombie with one of those weird arm things. So, if we can get that as a weapon, it'd be kind of nice. Oh, there's two of them. Okay! Oh, 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 no! Oh, 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 no! Okay, that's not good. That's not good. Um. That's really bad, actually. I, I know I should be running back towards the house, but I, you never live doing the right thing. Eh, I'm gonna die down here. This is it. This is, this is rip. Um. Oh, this is, this is totally rip. There's no sanctuary down here. What have I done? I, I did this, I did this to myself. There's nobody to blame but me. Hello? Uh, what have I done? 
Do an expert playthrough, they said. It would be fun, they said. I'm not having fun! Uh, guys! There's nobody here to save me. Wake me up. I'm gonna go down here and I'm gonna get murdered by antlion things. Oh, I can just feel it. Oh, I can hear them. Where are they at? Uh, they want to kill me. Oh, hey, look, there's one silver. Hi ho, silver! Way! Up oh, there, there's fa- Why are they so fast? I guess their name suits them now, at least. Alien Chargers. Oh, yay. You know, I usually hate ant lions, mainly for Half-Life reasons, but at this point, I would prefer the Half-Life ant lions over these guys. Oh, nice, some more silver that I'm not even going to get to use because I'm probably going to die down here. Ooh, that's not good, that's not good, that's not good, that's uh, not good. I am not at all comfortable with any of this, especially because I can't take those ant lions down. Like, that's the one thing I'm struggling with here, is that I can't fight these guys, you know, they're... I'm honestly just kind of testing my luck here and seeing how far I can get before I get murdered. Like, I'm decently far and I have yet to be got my face torn off yet, which is nice. Not gonna lie, I am enjoying it. I'm probably not doing like any of the things you should do in a, like, expert playthrough and all the expert, like, you know, gods and stuff who've managed to do expert mode in like 10 minutes are probably like, oh, okay. Oh, there's my inevitable fate. My plead for death was answered by an antlion charger. Oh, that's always nice. I love when my pleads for death can finally get answered. Well, at least I can go back to my house and make a cactus sword, hopefully. I don't know, we'll find out, I guess. Can I make a cactus sword? Ah, I can make a cactus sword, yeah. No, it only does one more damage than my wood sword, so, and my wood sword's a godly wood sword, so I'm just gonna say now, nah, keep it for now. But I can make some cactus armor, though. Which is pretty good at the moment, and I don't have enough stone now for a furnace, nice. Alright, well, I think I'm going to leave this episode of Terraria Expert Mode here. If you guys enjoyed it, and if you did, and if you want to see me get pulverized more in Expert Mode, let me know down below. Please leave a like on this video, show it some support, and as always, my little ones, I will see you in the next video. Bye! I'll leave the story, start